hello and welcome to my youtube channel thank you so much for stopping by welcome back if you are always been around with me or welcome if you are new i make videos on type 4 natural hair coming up in this video i tell you uh just the importance of moisturizing your hair moisturizing my natural type 4 hair has been game changing um, it's very important that we get our hair moisturized in order for the hair, the length that we've gained to stay on. It doesn't have to be expensive. You don't have to go out and buy all of these expensive products because the best, one of the best ways to moisturize your hair is actually just water. Good old water. It's cheap. It's not free because we have to pay the bills, but it is cheap. And so you don't have to go and try every moisturizing product that you see. Every product marked with moisturizing. No, because you have water. And that's the basis of getting your hair nice and subtle so that you can style it. We don't want our hair to dry out too much. We want to make sure that our hair is nice and moisturized so that we can retain the length or when we're styling our hair that it's able to take the styling without breaking or when we comb through our hair that we're not losing breakage hair. So I'm going to go into this, um, this recipe for you which is very, very cheap. It's very, very simple and it keeps my hair moisturized for days. I also use it on my daughter's hair um, and their small children and it also works for them um, just a side note one of them is totally 4c one is more 4a and um, mixture of both and so it works for both of our hair types mm -hmm. and so the first ingredient you'll need is hello hydration i've talked about hello hydration a lot on my channel it's quite cheap you can get the smaller version from poundland and then i'm showing you there a castor oil that my i was gifted um, from jamaica um, and it is actual real just really nice castor oil and the fact that it's actually from the source is you know it's great I, I love to get that as a gift anytime and then you need um uh, extra virgin olive oil and that one is from Aldi it's quite cheap I also pick up these um these mixture bottles from the pound shop anytime I see them because it gives me um a, a good size to make enough of the product obviously it's got lots of natural ingredients in there and I don't want it to go off in any way so I just make a small amount um, probably that will serve me for a week or two and so I just add the ingredients to the bottle and mix them one by one I don't think it actually matters what order you put these in but I am putting just about a tablespoon so there you've got just a tablespoon of the hello hydration in the bottle and so I just squeeze it in there I'm just you know I was actually just creating this recipe and I thought I just might as well share it on, on YouTube I was trying to do something very quick so you'll put about a tablespoon of the hello hydration a bit more it depends on your lightning of for the thickness of how you like your leave-in conditioner and then you're gonna fill the bottle up um, just above about halfway um, with water because it's mainly water our hair mainly just needs water to stay moisturized and so I give that a good shake Till it's nice and creamy and then i go ahead and add the oils in as i said i don't think the order is important it's about a tablespoon of each product and mainly water and it, it's just a great um it's just a great product it's nice and cheap it's great for all our hair types and i just normally just keep this right where our toothbrush is and while we are brushing our teeth we just quickly put some in our hair um, and i'm adding the uh, olive oil into it again about a tablespoon or two olive oil is great for my hair i also use it as a pre poo and this bottle from aldi which is just a, a it's really good size um for the for the price and then i add the castor oil as i said i really love this castor oil and the fact that you, you can see the bottle you know it's coming straight from jamaica um and so i just i just rub those all in together i shake it all in together it's not going to mix together because obviously it's water and oil but it's it's just easier than me putting all of these ingredients on my hair separately and so i just mix them all together in this bottle and there you have it just a really nice good cheap um leave-in conditioner that you know you can use on your your hair uh, if you're long-term protective styling if you're just um styling your hair on a normal day um, keeping your hair moisturized as I said is very very important for us type 4 naturals because our hair dries out so much quickly and um, you know we're styling it so much and trying to be so creative on it we're pulling it here and pulling it there so it really needs to be moisturized so go ahead and section your hair if that's the way you choose to moisturize your hair um, I'm sectioning my hair here so that I can get the product all over my hair from root to tip and I focus mainly on the ends of my hair because they are the oldest part of my hair and therefore they need more attention. So I'm definitely making sure that the ends of my hair is moisturized um, and I'm giving it a good amount. As I said, I create, I, I make enough 
of this um, in in that bottle for about a, a week or two um, and because it's got that oil the got it's got the oils in there it will stay on your hair for quite a while at least two days it will still be moisturized so I hope you enjoyed this recipe I'm just gonna go ahead and finish applying it to my hair um, and I hope you can um, you probably have these ingredients I hope you don't have to go and buy them um, as I said that you know you, you probably have the olive oil um, in your kitchen and then the castor oil most of us have that hanging around and the hello hydration I think any other cheapy conditioner is fine as well so just mix together things that you have at home and they work I also transfer it to um, my spray bottle so it's the same pack of um, containers from pound nine and then I just you know obviously use the spray the spray bottle version one when I am in crochet braids just to make sure that my hair underneath my protective style is moisturized there's no point having um, protective style if you're not really looking after your own natural hair so it's very important that while you have braids in while you are protective styling that your hair is moisturized I uh, hope you enjoy the recipe and uh, give it a try and come come and comment and let me know how you like it thank you so much once again for stopping by my channel I uh, hope you're blessed having a blessed day uh, take care till the next video